even though Muhammad Ali is training in Deer Lake, Pennsylvania for his rematch with Ken Norton, his mind and his mouth stretch all the way to Japan and the World Heavyweight Championship between King Roman and George Foreman. After I annihilate Ken Norton, going to Jakarta, Indonesia to whoop this Rudy Lubus, the Dutch heavyweight champion, I want to come back and settle this whole thing with George Foreman. And for old time's sakes, I want to whoop Joe Frazier again right there in Madison Square Garden. Now I'm tired. I got to go to work. I ain't got no time to be talking, playing, and jiving because I'm working. I said, last night, I had a dream. When I got to Africa, I had one hell of a rumble. I had to beat Tarzans behind first for claiming to be the king in the jungle. For this fight, I've wrestled with alligators. I've tussled with a whale. I done handcuffed lightning and put thunder in jail. You know I'm bad. I have murdered a rock. I injured a stone and I hospitalized a brick. I'm so bad, I make medicine sick. I'm so fast, man, I can run through a hurricane and don't get wet. When George Fulmer meets me, he'll pay his debt. I can drown a drink of water and kill a dead tree. Wait till you see Muhammad Ali. There's a great possibility, fellas, that this might be my last fight tonight. A great possibility, you probably saw the last of Ali. I'm concerned, considering retiring, to let Norton, Fulman, Frazier, whoever, fight for the title. I want to get out of it. I have the people thinking I'm fat. I have the people thinking I'm old. I'm at the end of the line. Now they will see how great I am. Champ, Bobby. Muhammad Ali, 100 kilograms. 220.46 pounds, Muhammad Ali. I am the greatest fighter of all time. And when I hit you with a hard right hand, you will fall. Same breath. He's got to beat people like Ken Norton, Jimmy Young, Ernie Schaefer. So he's got to go through these people before people really start believing that it's not just accident or it's lucky. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.